Hi friends. So, um, I thought I would just start taking some video. Mike is uh, attempting to fix our ATV. And I was like, maybe I'll just go and film Mike doing a thing. And he's open to it, so I'm not just, you know, surprise videoing him. <laughs> but I thought we'd start outside here. Um, this is the, the uh, shipping container we bought last fall, which has been a game changer for us. And Mike built some great storage inside also. And here's our ATV that was wonderfully gifted to us by Mike's dad. Dennis. Thank you, Dad. Thanks, Dad. And here's Mike, working on a thing. Hey, guys. <laughs> what are you doing? Well, I am... When, uh... What happened? When we were... Oh, when we were putting all the stuff in storage, I was running the ATV out of gas, like, because I wanted to store it without gas, because I had a fuel tank thing I needed to repair. And literally, it ran out of gas as I was trying to drive it into the uh, container, which was perfect, kind of. And then I just used the winch to pull us in the rest of the way. But I got the, the winch all bound up. The winch is a little janky, I think. And it, and it bound up, so I have to just pull the winch apart, and now I'm trying to fix it. And I got it un, uh, I got it free, so the cable's not stuck anymore, but now I'm trying to put it all back together. So hopefully I get it back together and it works. So, yeah, and then I bought a new fuel grommet for the fuel tank. The right part number, they sent it in the package with the right part number and everything, and it's the wrong part. It's just too small. So that's back on the drawing board. And so that's what's going on in here. Okay, thanks for the update. Yeah. I'm going to show everyone your awesome shelving okay. units that you made to make this uh, container uh, more user friendly. As you can see, this is kind of Mike's tool bench storage area. Now we're going into the, the black depths. And now we get into all of our kind of the stuff that we kept from when we sold our little house in town that was in a storage unit for a couple of years. And now it's in here. Look, here's my writing desk. <laughs> File cabinet, which you can see. <laughs> Oh, there you go. A bunch of these um, foam blocks. I think we're left for, over from a job that we held on to because those can come in handy. Some mattresses. Got all sorts of good stuff in here. So we've got one side lined with shelving. The other side for sort of bulk stuff. Here's a, a wood, wood stove, barrel stove for a large canvas wall tent that we bought off Craigslist last fall, which we have yet to assemble, which is somewhere in here, this area. <laughs> so, there's that. Okay, bye! You can't hear me. <laughs> oh, bye! <laughs> oh, okay. Why are you talking to the camera? <laughs> So we have um, many projects out here at Empty Mountain uh, and we're just kind of doing things one step at a time as we're able, slow and steady. I talk about that often, slow and steady and uh, we're doing, doing what we can, doing what we can and we're breathing and we're smiling, we're doing our best.